So hey guys, a couple of days before our recent trip, I got an email from YouTube uh, saying that one of my videos had been flagged for some reason or another and was uh, marked as age restricted. Now, I really didn't know exactly what that was about or what that meant, and I kind of really wasn't uh, focusing on it too much before the trip, but I uh, was suggested by a couple folks that I appeal, so I made the attempt and it was uh, it was denied. Um, to tell you the truth, I don't really understand exactly what it is that is objectionable because it was a, a video of um, my mermaid tail, and that was really all it was. Um, but you know, it, it's somehow indicated that it was, uh, I guess, it, you know, not appropriate for children or something, even though. I mean, nothing I do is produced for kids, and nothing I do is produced, uh, you know, nothing I do is explicit, or at least I try not to. Um, and, I mean, I, you know, I have to admit I don't entirely understand exactly uh, what it is that I violated or, or what that uh, exactly occurred. Um, you know, I mean, it's been on, on the platform for who knows how long, so I don't really know exactly why it happened now. But I overall don't think that it's going to be too much of a hindrance at the moment. Basically what it boils down to is that you have to be over 18 and you have to be logged in in order to be able to view my videos. Which I initially uh, thought might hinder uh, channel growth, but it's not like my channel's growing by leaps and bounds right now anyway. Um, I suppose that it's just... Uh, I mean, I... I Really, I guess I don't see it as too much of a negative because it's not like the folks that you know don't have a YouTube or Google account or whatnot are probably looking at my videos anyway. And uh, it's uh, I didn't get a strike against my account. You know, it doesn't it doesn't uh, mark as a negative against my channel. Uh, you know, it's just, apparently, it's just age-restricted, which means that if you're not logged in and you don't have an account, you can't see it. Which, you know, I mean, it shouldn't affect anybody that's subscribed to my channel, because I think everybody that is uh, already fits that category. But, and, you know, if not, you wouldn't be able to see this anyway. But, overall, I mean, it's not really going to change too much on my end, because uh, I'm just going to keep doing what I'm doing and uh, you know producing content for the 200 some odd of you that actually watch my channel and the 20 some odd folks of you that watch most of the videos so um, but other than that it's mostly just an FYI and just kind of to, to mention what uh, what occurred and you know I mean maybe I could have done a better job with the appeal I'm not exactly sure if uh, you know I just said I didn't see anything objectionable in it but I'll admit I didn't really understand what the issue was, and I still don't. But you know, I, I uh, ex you know I accept uh, whatever's going on, and and you know, I mean, all I can do is just keep doing my best. So I mean, that's that. But just as an FYI, if you're wondering, um, you know, in order to view my channel in the future, you have to be logged in, and you have to uh, have uh, that you're over 18 in your account. But you know, hopefully in the long run it won't have any kind of deleterious effects on my channel. I can't imagine it would at this moment. You know, I mean, it's not like I purposely try to, to you, know, uh, you know, I try to follow all the rules and such, but um, I guess that's about it as far as that's concerned. I don't know if anybody else has any experience with that sort of thing or any suggestions. I kind of think it's a little bit, uh, I guess a little bit unfair that you only get exactly one appeal and then that's it you know I mean that I kind of think is is you know I don't know it just it feels like it's too easy to make the appeal and the appeal that I had was rejected within minutes and you know maybe I you know again I, I acknowledge that I don't entirely understand uh, what the issue was and that I may have uh, you know I probably could have done a better job with with uh, the appeal because all I just said was I didn't think it was objectionable but, I don't know. I mean, it, it really didn't feel like uh, whatever it was that uh, caused the issue in the first place explained well to me, and I didn't really feel like 
uh, if there, you know, if there is any gravity to the situation, that it was explained well, or that uh, there was, you know, it makes it easy to file an appeal, but not really easy to, uh, I don't know, it's just like, after you, after you send it in, it just, I don't know, it just, it just seems like there really wasn't much of a process before it was just spat back as denied. But in any case, like I said, I don't really necessarily, uh, you know, it's not, I'm not com really complaining. It's just, I don't know, I guess I just don't understand the whole thing. But in any case, such it is, it is what it is. So, you know, we just uh, go forward from here, I guess. But thanks for watching anyway, and uh, catch you guys later. Thanks for watching, and if you liked it, click the subscribe button and leave a comment below. You can also find me on Twitter and a few other places on the web, or support me via Patreon or Ko-fi. Zebra hugs!